I am going to show you how to store your iTunes backups onto an external hard drive. You can also use this process with other apps as well. The first thing you want to do is download Symbolic Linker. The link will be in the description. As you can see here, I'm just running through the download process at the moment. With this option, every new backup will be stored onto your external hard drive and is not affected by restarts. Once it's downloaded, open up the DMG. Then you want to locate your internal hard drive disk. Mine was on my desktop, but if yours is not, then you want to open up the finder and it should be on the left hand side column. Open up the library folder and create a new folder within that called services with a capital S. Once you have done that, you can drag the symbolic linker up into that folder. Next, you want to right click on the symbolic linker and open it. Now I'm going to check whether the first part of the process has worked so you want to right click on a file go to services and see if it says make symbolic link at the bottom now that it has worked we're going to move on to the next step now from your desktop you want to click on go at the top press alt on your keyboard and library should appear open that then click on application support and then look for mobile sync or sync. Once you've done that, you'll see your backup folder for iTunes. Then what you want to do is open up your external storage or where you want your backups to go. And whilst holding command, drag the backup folder to that location. Make sure you don't release command until it's fully dragged and dropped to the external storage. Now you want to create a symbolic link by right clicking on it, going to services and then clicking on make symbolic link. Once that is done, you'll see another folder with an arrow on it. You want to drag that to the mobile sync folder, holding down command like we did before. And you want to edit the name and delete the symbolic part. So it just says backup how the original folder was. Now the process is completed. I'm just going to run some tests to make sure it has worked. Now I'm going to try back up my phone to see if it works. Just to note that you can do this process without downloading Symbolic Linker by using the terminal. But I think this is an easy option for beginners. The process has successfully worked and I'm just going to delete the backups that I've already created and try the process one more time to see if it works. As you can see, it's created a backup straight into that external storage.